Hi girls, so today I'm going to be doing a video especially for you on five fragrances that are actually marketed towards men that I really, really, really highly recommend that you check out. Honestly, we could get into a massive uh, rant about it, or I could get into a rant about it of how uh, labeling fragrances as women, men, it's really stupid. Obviously, just wear what you want, you know? If you like uh, very masculine fragrances that are dark and heavy and have oud and are very masculine, then wear it, you know? Nobody cares. It's at the end of the day, you know, at the end of the day, fragrances are supposed to be personal and make you happy to wear them. And they should, it's the same with buying like luxury items or things in general you know you buy things that make you happy you don't just buy them for the sake of it i'm going to stop talking about it now but it's really like girls if you're watching you should really try some men's fragrances because the ones i have here to me are perfectly unisex and maybe they're a little masculine for the people that like coco mademoiselle love your bell giorgio Armani c but if you're somebody who likes more you know unisex dark mysterious uh, different fragrances then these ones are definitely going to appeal to you in general check them out i really recommend it so let's just get into it i have five here three designers and two niche so the first one that i have here is dior homme intense now this fragrance to me is 100 percent unisex in the way that it smells it's oh it's wow this fragrance is wow and to me even even a little more feminine to be honest with you girls it's powdery, creamy, very buttery. It has iris, amberette, has like this marshmallowy sweetness to it. Not marshmallow, of course, but it has this fluffy sweetness to it. It's so, so beautiful, this fragrance. I personally love wearing this scent in the winter, like the fall and winter, with a beautiful like Maximara coat. My dream, like I don't have a Max Mara coat, but I really want to get one, but they're super expensive, so I'll wait. But a Max Mara coat, cashmere scarf, just beautiful. This is just a wow scent. It's very long lasting as well. It lasts a very long time. It projects a lot, and it's just beautiful. Like I said, powdery, sweet. Um, it has an aromatic touch from some lavender in there, but it's just beautiful. The way that they compose the Dior Homme line is legendary. Like it's really legendary what Dior did with this line. My opinion, the best line from Dior. Dior Homme Intense. This is Dior Homme Intense. A lot of people like the Parfum, the original. Me personally, my favorite is the Intense. And it's marketed towards men, but stuff that because the fragrance is 100% unisex. Next up is Herod from Mali. You girls know if you watch me that I always recommend, <clears throat> sorry, I always recommend this fragrance to girls as well as guys because for me, this is not only one of the sexiest fragrances that I've ever smelled on a man, my boyfriend wears it, thank God, but it is also incredibly sexy on a woman, myself included. I wear this one myself and it's one of those fragrances that trams, tram? transforms the way that i feel about myself like i spray it on again fall and winter scent has tobacco cinnamon vanilla if you like a killian back to black you would probably like herod from mali same with like tobacco vanille from tom ford if you like those sort of fragrances that have that tobacco that edge the sweetness gourmand touches you're gonna love herod but for me this just transforms the way that i feel i feel so sexy i like to wear it again in the fall and winter for a night out uh when i want to show off you know when i want to be noticed and i want to feel very sexy i like to wear herod so yeah, like I said, it has this kind of vanilla sweetness. The vanilla is so beautiful. And here it has tobacco. It has this kind of cherry syrup vibe to it, almost, like just a little bit. It's got this beautiful cinnamon touches. It's just gorgeous, guys. Herod from Mali. Again, marketed towards men. I don't know why, because it's amazing. Okay, so next up is actually Tom Ford Noir Extreme. Now, if you girls watch me, you know I love the Tom Ford Noir Parfum, but I'm going to be 100% honest right now. It smells so similar to the Noir Extreme for men, and I actually prefer the Noir Extreme. I'm just saying, if you already bought off my recommendation with Tom Ford Noir Pour Femme, try out the Noir Extreme. They smell so similar, but there's something in the Noir Extreme for men that I prefer. It's more creamy. It has like the same feeling as the women's version, exactly the same. But there's something about this one that I just love much more. Like I love it much more, I wear it much more. It is just beautiful. I think it's a little creamier and uh, a little sweet, spicy, ambery, vanilla, creamy. Uh, 
it's just delicious guys it's delicious i love it and like i said i recommend it more than i actually recommend the noir pour femme this is the noir extreme sorry if that was a little confusing but i love it and don't let it steer you away if it just says for men you know it's literally the same scent but this is better spice bomb extreme from victor and rolf yes guys this fragrance is just amazing it is just amazing maybe it's a little masculine maybe but to me i love to wear it myself i think it smells absolutely amazing this fragrance drives me crazy again it's actually one of my favorite designer fragrances on a man for like the fall and winter in general summer autumn winter spring but it is more of a fall winter scent it has vanilla tobacco amberette lavender it's like this beautiful sweet spicy very loud it projects a lot it's just gorgeous guys it is absolutely gorgeous and i highly recommend that you check this one out even just try it try it on your skin and see what you think but i know if you have the same taste as me personally which i like more ufa greatness uh, carlisle from mali uh, i'm trying to think of what else you guys know what i love <laughs> and if you love what i love you're going to need to check this one out because it's just amazing and don't let the label steer you spice bombing stream from victor and rolf there will definitely be some girls that are like uh, no way this is way too masculine but in my eyes like it's it's okay it's very unisex to me spice bomb extreme and finally we have straight to heaven extreme from killian now this one is actually unisex it's marketed men and women but i feel like this scent is more like men talk about it men wear it it's a men's scent which men no it's not your scent this is for women as well this is for women who are like badass ceo don't mess with me don't talk to me which i love the vibe of killian scents like that like the vodka on the rocks the black phantom intoxicated straight to heaven extreme they're very like ceo like they make me feel a certain way when i put on a killian i feel a certain way apart from like a uh, good girl gone bad or love by killian they're more sweet and innocent this one is sexy i'm telling you guys this one is sexy it has this beautiful like creaminess to it like there's a creamy feeling to it it has a boozy note in here some dried fruits but i really get this like sandalwood creaminess from it along with the little boozy note in there it has a nuttiness too i think there's nutmeg in here if i'm not wrong but i really get this like nutty creaminess from this scent which at the moment guys just fyi i am obsessed i'm going through a phase right now of loving nutty creamy sandalwood which i've always loved sandalwood in my fragrances but i'm obsessed like i went through my gourmand phase i went through my tube rose phase i went through my rose oud phase and now i'm into a sandalwood creamy vibe phase and they're the scents that I'm obsessed with and I love. So straight to heaven extreme, guys. Check it out. Even though it says men and women, I feel like more men tend to wear this scent than women. And you shouldn't because it's just amazing. So that is it, girls. I hope that you enjoyed this video of men's fragrances that I really recommend that you check out. And I'm sure that you will find one of these if you like the same taste as me, that vibes your taste and you love. So thank you for watching and I will talk to you girls soon. Bye-bye.